So in Work Package 3, we'll be conducting a randomised clinical trial. And what we will be doing is taking people with high blood pressure and we will be giving them different drugs. They'll get three different drugs or four different drugs, depending on which part of the trial they go into. And the order that they get the drugs in is completely random. So it's determined by chance, like tossing a coin. And that's a good way of doing clinical trials because it means there's less bias in the trial. What we're really trying to do is work out what the best treatment is for people with high blood pressure from diff different ethnic groups. So we want to determine what the best single drug is and what the best combination of drugs is for people with high blood pressure. So in our clinical trial, our hypothesis is that the response to blood pressure drugs will differ between different ethnic groups, which are commonly found in the UK. So we're looking at white, black, and South Asian people with hypertension. The main locations to start with will be London, Cambridge, Manchester, Birmingham and Glasgow. And then we'll bring on other centres like Cardiff, Leicester. So in order to enter the clinical trial, we're basically looking for people with high blood pressure. So these will be people who've been told by a doctor or a nurse that their blood pressure is raised. And that's the main criteria for going into the trial. It doesn't matter whether you're a man or a woman. And you also have to fit into one of the three ethnic groups that we're talking about. So you have to define yourself as white, black or South Asian. The most obvious thing is what ethnic group you place yourself into and your blood pressure. We'll also look at some other measures of your physiology, your vascular function. Um, so things like your heart rate, your, uh, how much blood's being pumped around simple things that we can measure simply without putting needles into people. So it's all non-invasive measurements. Then we'll be taking some blood and urine to look at metabolomic things. They're things which occur in your blood, which are proteins or other substances. And finally, we'll be taking some blood to look at uh, genetic markers of ancestry. And there will be between um, six and eight visits, depending on which trial you go into, so the single therapy or the two therapies, and it will take between 24 and 36 weeks to complete the trial. And most of the things we're doing, apart from taking the blood, are completely painless, non-invasive and shouldn't cause any discomfort at all. And I think one of the clear benefits will be that we'll be using drugs that are commonly available and you may get by going to see a GP anyway, but by giving them in an order and measuring the blood pressure after each of them, we can work out what the best drug for you is. So if you're interested in coming into the trial, the best thing to do is to look at our website and on the website you'll find details of different centres in the UK with emails, phone numbers and websites that you can apply to join the trial through. If I'm a patient with high blood pressure, what is the best drug for me to take? And is that drug different between people of different ethnic groups? Because we have no data at the moment in the United Kingdom to tell us what drug to give to different ethnic groups. And I think that's a really important question for a condition that's really common and is the most important cause of death across the whole world.